Hey everybody! Hey everybody! <laughs> Thanks for checking out my imprints on a blog. This is where I sit and I talk about spiritual uh, topics that I need to talk about to like keep my life together. And I sweat and I detox and I <sighs> give thanks and um, meditate and try to reinforce the messages that I talk about in my meditations. So um, tomorrow is a new moon eclipse and it's the beginning of eclipse season which is a really intense time and really a time for transformation, letting go, um, really embracing your abundance and focusing on what opens your heart and moves your heart and letting go of the things that are no longer serving us because it's kind of like a build up over six months of intense energy. And so tomorrow is the first in the series and um, there's a great astrologer I listen to called Leo King and you can check him out. I'll put his link. But so I'll probably put this video up tonight or tomorrow just because even though I already just put one up I'm going to go ahead because of the new moon and the eclipse energy you want to put things out there for manifesting and I really want to focus on this topic which is that own your shit right there's no time to be a victim and the moment you know say you're faced with some really serious challenges which you know we've all been facing challenges and transformations and facing our fears and all these things and say you have to face a really serious challenge in your <laughs> my phone's blowing up I forgot to turn it up anyway and you're um, scared you know of the outcome or the reaction or the situation and how it might unfold and it gives you panic and it gives you a feeling of helplessness and or panic and the initial reaction is to blame you know and to say well you know you could help me or you know you, if you didn't do this then I wouldn't be in this situation or um, you know whatever it is pointing fingers anywhere but here and so you know hey I made the decision to do whatever and or it's not your responsibility to bail me out you know I'm in this because of all the decisions I made <laughs> you know so when you own and, and are accountable for your situation and your what you have to face and address and deal with that's the first step of moving out of it okay addressing the fear and overcoming that fear what is the worst thing that can happen okay I can deal with that I, it may be uncomfortable but I can handle it you know the moment you throw away the victim hat and become accountable for your situation whatever it is however it manifested it was because of every single thought word and decision that you made and I'm pointing right at myself in this you know or every fear that you carried around like a bag or heavy heavy load all this time is manifesting again and again the same issues so that you finally take that off and move out of that right so my point is is that own your shit you know because the moment you do is the moment you can transform and the moment you can change your situation because if you're a victim and you're pointing the finger at everybody else that in itself keeps you stuck in this terrible situation whatever it is right Whew. in a way it's heavy because you know you have to you have to man up or woman up or goddess up you have to own your power throw fear away and just say okay I'm gonna deal with this I'm gonna fix it because if I acknowledge it and be responsible for it then I can fix it and if I'm not acknowledging responsibility or being accountable then I can't fix it because it's not my problem I didn't do it but we all did it right Whew, serious business <laughs> taking my power back I'm being accountable. I'm going to meditate on that. I'm going to ask for help from the universe. I'm going to focus on my gratitude of all the blessings that I do have, which will help me deal with the 
issues that I also have. All right, so that's my message today. I'm sweating bullets. It's 135 degrees in here. I've got like 40 minutes to go. Please subscribe. <laughs> Please subscribe. I think we can all learn from this. I certainly do. And so I really appreciate the views and thank you so much. And I hope everybody's handling all this. Remember to put your manifestations and put your intentions out to the world tomorrow in only a positive way. Do a ritual, whatever. Just say what I intend to manifest in this new eclipse, new moon eclipse energy. It's powerful stuff. Okay, so thanks so much. And... Oh,